What's going on YouTube, Mr. 1013 here with another review. This time we're looking at the 30th anniversary Edwin Lifeline Sting Rescue Trooper figure. Um, yes, this is uh, Lifeline, like I said, from the 30th anniversary. And uh, this is a dope figure. I mean, I got him as well from um, ToySource.com. Be sure to check them out. Free shipping on over 150 bucks. They just added a whole bunch of G.I. Joe blue figures and everything on there. So be sure to check them guys out. Very nice shipping and packaging. Um, so yeah, check them out. Throw a link in the description. Um, Lifeline. Like I said, it comes with a, a hefty amount of gear. Um, just a well put together figure. Looks just great. Minor update to the... Um, a real American hero version. And um, I'm going to give you his read up. You guys can pause that so you can um, get uh, the background on Lifeline. <clears throat> and let's get into some of these. Well, let's get into the accessories that he came with. Of course, he came with the gurney. With the strap, excuse me. Very nice. Nice little details, not like a regular plastic. It actually has like um, some detail on there, if you guys can see that. Yeah, has some detail on there, so it's just not like a solid plastic. Very nice. The strap it comes with to hold the Joes down. He also comes with nice assault rifle. Got that a few times. Very nice. A pistol that does go in this holster right here. He also comes with a knife, an injection needle, injection gun. He comes with, uh, I don't see it on there. Basically, go um, the oxygen mask, the oxygen. I believe it's O2. <laughs> but uh the oxygen, you throw that on there. Nice, very nice detail on those. Also comes with the holes for the IV, which is in the suitcase right here, and that does come out as well as the um the two electrical, I can't think of the technical term for them, but you know these are the clear. Put them on the chest, revive them, get a heart start beating. Throw a link in this uh <laughs> Throw a uh, comment in there if you got the technical name for these things. But uh, anyway, very nice, you know, um, gear similar to, I believe it's the Doc from the Retaliation, not Retaliation, from the um, Rise of Cobra. Got all kind of like the similar gear, I believe. Um, I haven't cracked that dude up in a little while, but comes in a briefcase, closes up pretty good. Rescue on the front, playing on the back. Let's take a look at Lifeline. Get him up here. Lifeline is a very dope character. Comes with the Lifeline G.I. Joe stand. Helmet is removable. It's also dope. Let's take a 360 of them real quick. Like I said, a great update to the original figure. Very nice parts. Very nice paint apps. Good to go. I wish they would have this knee pad. I wish they could have just finished painting rescue over the knee pad so we can get the full um, word on there. But take a look at our articulation. Head does a 360. Arms go out. 360 at the shoulder. <clears throat> Spins and bends at the elbow. Spins at the wrist. Hinge the wrist. Torso does a 360. Ab crunch. Legs go legs go out. Double jointed knees. Foot pivots and spins. No rockers. Very solid figure. Glad I was able to pick him up from again Toy Source. They um I got him for about uh 25 bucks. Which is pretty cool because I seen him on um like amazon for like 35 almost 40 bucks 
but definitely a great find. Um, pick up and just to help complete that uh, Real American Hero collection, having these guys a part of it. And um, yeah, that's it. Um, that's it for the uh, review for uh, Lifeline 30th Anniversary GI Joe. Until next time, guys, peace.